Hi, hi, I'm Alistair. First, thank you so much for checking out this video. In this video, I'm just going to give you some background knowledge on what is Infotica and what are the use cases of it and I'm going to help you to make whether this is uh, the right solution for you or not. So without going into the video directly, I just wanted to let you know, uh, if you in any point of the video, you wanted to try it out, uh, they are offering a free trial period without credit card and you can cancel anytime. And only if you are after trying it out and if you are happy, you can buy it out and use the service. And also I have an exclusive coupon code for 15% and it is linked in the video below. If you want, you can use it. Okay, now let's get into the video. Okay, so what is Infotica? Infotica is a global peer-to-peer -peer business proxy network. They offer two different types of proxies. One, it is for data center proxy. These are the proxies which you want to use to have high speed uh, connection and also to just to mask your IP without uh, worrying too much about your anonymity. What I mean is these are usually not uh, linked to an ISP like an end user like a residential user. These are the IPs basically coming out of a server. So what it means is it will give really high speed of connections but if someone able to trace back they would be able to see it is coming from a server or data center something like that. Uh, the second one this is the most interesting for me which is the residential proxies. What it means is these are actual users. Uh, who are spread out throughout the world. These are residential proxies. Currently in their database, they have over 10 million plus uh, residential proxies and also 20k US mobile proxies also available. These are, these are not illegal in any way. What it means is these are all uh, user IP address, real users, not fake or data center or something like that. These are real user IP address who gave their consent to provide their IP address and use it uh, for fu functionalities when the device is lying idle. So these are ethically gained IP address and not uh, any way in illegal or any black hat technique or something like that. All the services provided here in Infotica is purely white hat and you don't need to worry about any uh, illegal or any other uh, underhanded methods here. These are pure whited guys okay uh, so how you can choose which one is best for you if you're just looking to get fastest data using set of ip to block just in a, you want to change your ip address and get something fast then data center ip will be best for you if you want to get the how the real user will feel like how the some data will be shown to real user when you are penetrating, doing a penetration test on your app or something, how you want to simulate the real user activity, then residential IP uh, will be the best. The cool thing about residential IP is they also dynamically rotated. What that means is they have the pool of 10 million plus IP. What it means is every one hour you will rather than getting a data center IP address like uh, some numbers dot port and username password here what they will give you is they will give you a dynamic IP and port and you need to whitelist for an IP to use and that dynamic uh, IP address will automatically keep on getting a different IP every hour so you will keep on refreshing your list there is will be an also option to refresh your list on the dashboard uh, let me quickly show you guys how it will look like the dashboard before I explain the use cases for you. Okay, this is how the back end of the system will look like. For example, currently I have one service. If I go over here, I can see the back end of that dashboard. Here I can see the uh, service which I have purchased now. If I click here, it will directly take me to the details page. Here all I need to do is uh, I need to click on the proxy list. It will open up a new tab where I can copy paste all these things. These are the dynamic ports which I talked about. Rather than giving you a fixed number, now what they are giving is they are giving a dynamically allocated uh, proxy. So it will automatically keep on changing it. Uh, if you click on the rotate proxy list, it will automatically 
uh, get you new proxies for the dynamic ports and also you need to whitelist your IP. For example, if you're going to test this pro uh, proxies on a particular IP uh, uh, solution or something or from here you're going to use from this particular device uh, from this particular server then you can add multiple IP this means uh, we don't need to use username and password instead it when we automatically whitelisted the IP it will automatically make this dynamic proxies use from that and no one can use this by copying this and using it on an unauthorized uh, server or device you can also see that visual traffic data sets and everything from here it will show you how much data you've been using all the details it will be showing from here okay now let me directly show you guys what how the uses use cases for this first uh, these are useful various with your imagination is your limitation and also according to your use case for example you can use this for advertising net work monitoring see how the local ads are performing on the end user you can control ppc quality control to see how the it, uh, your ads are showing on different markers budgets and everything localized search to get results from that particular location according to the way because when we use this it will automatically use that residential ip address to get the results all these white ad security purchase validation all these are possible uh, some of the client profile that you can use is one it's not mentioned here it's good for such founders where if they want to test out their application to see whether that is performing well or they want to get some sort of data for such application and everything they can do it by just uh, using these proxies to get the data they deserve and also you can use as a price aggravator where if you are doing some kind of comparison website or a platform in that case if you want to get accurate local pricing on various stuff if you are using just in a basic proxy list or your basic without any IP there are chances very high chances to getting that IP band and all this for that purposes you can use residential IPs to get the data cyber security firms this is a critical one where we want to do some testing and want to make sure that your securities are in place and everything you can use this proxy network for that corporate protection for you can see how you can hide uh, your traces or your uh, traces and all the other things which are doing business processes by using proxy you can get better protections for it you can do uptime and performance monitoring where uh, you can measure uh, based on various location whether your server or your platform is running up and uh, smooth without any load time or additional problems on particular geolocation or something like that brand protection is available and also marketers this is really critical where i will be the most uh, winner of the use case because when we want to collect valuable data for our marketing activities and everything if it's a small case not a problem if we want to collect large number of data and all the things in that case we need to protect our ip address so that we won't be get blocked or something like that we can use these data uh, proxies to get the data and especially co data providers i will be creating couple of videos on that also how to use it actually where seo is a tough field where all the things are limited there are for example if you want to scrape uh, search engines it is limited uh, because it will only allow you to scrape a lot small amount of uh, amount after that it will throw captures block your ip all this stuff and again same thing like with collecting data for our on page or seo audit and everything we need to have a uh, unblocked access in order to do all these things keyword research we need to do and for that to collect data we need to have a good sort of uh, dynamic res replaceable fast residential proxy so that is good and also for your academy if you want to do something for your project or dissertation you won't get real data actual live data and in that case you can use this proxy network to make sure that you are getting uh, correct and uh, not restricted or unblocked data for your things. So the use cases are unlimited. I'm also glad that you can start using this uh, proxy uh, without any restriction on credit card requirement or try uh, uh, cancelling at any time. Just ask for the trial. They will give you. You use it. 
and if you are happy with what you are getting in the trial period then you can go for it so you don't need to worry about the risk or you don't need to worry about whether this is the correct solution for me or not you can try it out and if you want there is a 15 dollar coupon below in the description you can click on it and get that link that link is an affiliate link so if you decided to support me you can click on that link it does not affect your purchase price but it will help me to create more videos like this so i hope this video was useful if you have any uh, doubts or questions for uh, regarding infotica let me know and i will be explaining you thank you